I'm not like these guys where you sign a record deal when it was lit and now it's not lit, I'm crying on the internet. No, 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 my bro, I signed it. So if I signed it, I'm standing on it. It's too late. I should have thought about that then. Where do we go from here? You get what I'm trying to say? Well, a lot of people, they get the, they reap the rewards and then when it's not working the way in the favour no more, it's like, oh my God, they done me, they done this broski. It's man's fault. Shop, I lost the whole shop. It was my fault. I rented a studio, I marbled the floors, I spent five quid on it. Someone smoking there when I wasn't there with a vape, yeah? They said, oh, I breached my lease, I lost that too. Man, decorated as well, spent money on that as well. Whose fault is it? It's my fault. Because I should have leased it. You get what I'm trying to say to you, my bro? So, if you don't, if you see when you're always trying to push blame, ah, oh, it was this guy, this guy, brother, you, you're just going to be in the same situation again and again and again. Because you can't see where you're going wrong. You know what I'm trying to say? A lot of people don't see where they're going wrong. They want to blame, ah, oh, this was this person's fault, this was this person's fault. Nah, my bro. My whole life is, man, even my case, my brethren was talking crazy on his phone. But we're in jail because of me, because I did it, not him. If I didn't do it, it wouldn't have been in the first place. Do you understand? Of course, 